define your curls, use Lusters S Curl. I don't know if that's true, but I feel like that's how that commercial probably used to go back in the day. Hi, Milana Alicia here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is all about this Jerry Curl. I use this Lusters S Curl Curl Wave Gel Activator and this Lusters Oil Moisturizing Pink Lotion. If you want to watch this hilarious video of how I got this 80s Jerry Curl in 2020, stay tuned and watch this video. But first, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm starting on freshly washed hair that I divided into six sections, three on this side, three on this side. I'm going to go ahead and clip up these dookie braids to get them out of the way. The first section I'll be doing my little jerry curl on is this section back here. I'm going to go ahead and unbraid this section. To make this jerry curl, I'll be using this Lusters S Curl curl and wave gel activator. I don't know if you're supposed to use this with water or not, but it says that for best results, apply a moderate amount of gel activator into hands and rub together. It, it doesn't say if you need water first or not, so I'm just gonna use it without water to see how that works. It comes out as this blue liquid. Rub it in into my hands per directions. Ooh. I don't think it's doing anything. I don't think it's doing anything. My hair just feels it just feels wet. I'm gonna add some more. Mm. This doesn't feel right. It has that Jerry Curl shine for sure, that Jerry Curl wetness, but I don't see the curl definition yet. Well, it says after you've applied a liberal amount Go ahead and add some Lusters Pink Moisturizer. I went ahead and bought this sample size of the Lusters Oil Moisturizing Pink Lotion. I'm adding it on top of that S wave. My hair is very wet and very shiny, but it's not that defined. So I'm gonna add a bit more of this Lusters Pink Lotion. See, now I understand why people's hair was always wet and dripping back then because they had to add so much product is so wet but it's just not defined y'all it's dripping look it is dripping my hair is just wet and shiny but it's not defined so what i'm gonna do is add some wet line extreme gel on top of this s curl and on top of this pink lotion See, now we're getting some curl definition. All we needed was a little extra gel to help. So that's our first section done. Now I'm moving to the second section. Let me take it out of this clip and unbraid it. Adding in this Luster's S curl. I'm not sure if it's because I have a low porosity hair, medium porosity. I honestly don't know what the porosity of my hair is. It just does what it wants. But I, this just sort of sits on top of my hair and it just stays wet and shiny, but it doesn't go inside and give me any curl definition. So this is my hair just with the Lusters S curl. And like it says, we follow up with this pink lotion. This smells like a perm. It has, this pink lotion has sort of a perm smell. I hope it's not gonna alter my hair in any type of way. And now I'm adding this wet lime extreme gel to give my curls a little extra pop. You know, we gotta get a little bit more definition if we want the jerry curl. We can't be walking around with just dripping hair. We need some curl definition too. Here are the back two sections after our little jerry curl method. 
moving on to this middle section. This is what it looks like with just this S curl. More pink lotion. It's just wet. I feel like my hand went through a car wash. Some extreme gel. Moving on to our other middle section. Need a bit more um no, put a bit more um in it. See, I think what, what we gotta do is you gotta add a lot of this S curl to get that definition because I added a lot of S curl to this section and it's looking good. It's wet and shiny, but I got some definition finally. You just gotta add a lot. Some of this pink lotion. This is the definition with just the S curl and the pink lotion without adding any gel to it. This section looks good because I added a lot more product in it, but I'm gonna add some gel anyway. I'm halfway done with this jerry curl, but oh my God, y'all, look, my chest is dripping wet. My back is probably wet. Look like I just got out the shower, but this is just these chemicals dripping from my hair, I'm feeling highly flammable right now. I do not want to walk up near any flames because is this flammable? Because I think this stuff is, I think these products are flammable. I, I just feel really dangerous and wet and shiny right now, but you know, it's looking good. It's looking shiny. My soul is glowing, as they used to say. I'm just gonna go ahead and move on to this front section here. And slip to fell out my hand. I do not like the smell of this pink lotion, y'all. It just doesn't smell safe. Why well, it smell like that? It's not like I'm putting that whole perm in my head. I don't trust that smell. See, look, we look, we're doing a whole lot better now without that front line extreme gel, but I'm still gonna add that gel anyway. This is funny to me because when I first big chopped, well, my second big chop when I was in college, people used to always tell me, hey, Milan, it looks like you have a jerry curl because I didn't know how to do my natural hair. And so I would always put a whole bunch of gel and it would just be wet like all day, just always dripping because I used to do like wash and goes every day because that's all I knew how to do. And now look at me purposely doing a jerry curl even though people made fun of me for it for years on oh, just this last section. I pretty much use this whole bottle but I have a big head. This is just a definition with only the S curl. Adding in this Luster's Pink Lotion. This is the definition with the S curl and the Luster's Pink Lotion. Adding this wet line extreme gel just for some extra curl enhancements. Okay, y'all, my jerry curl is done. <laughs> my chest is still so wet. Like, look, you see this? Like, my I don't know when my hair is gonna stop dripping. I hope it stops dripping soon because this is just uncomfortable at this point. I do like these results. Like, let me just give you a quick spin around of how this jerry curl is looking. I would love for Lusters to make these products, this, this Lusters S curl and this Lusters pink lotion work for natural hair people for people who want to get curly hair for people who want that wet look jerry curl look i would love for them to make these products but with a less drip consistency because i this does look 
you can't deny it this does look good it's shiny it's moisturized it is defined but it's just too wet thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed this jerry curl tutorial make sure you like comment and especially subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in my next video bye